Some folks I know keep looking for rare old coins and stamps, while others see what's cooking with antique books and lamps. Some hobbies are like slavery. There's one too tough for words. This gal has got an Avery, and you should see her birds. <laughs> She's got Chanticleers and Dicky birds, intelligent and tricky birds that make the boys hang around. Her crow is black and shiny. Her hummingbirds are tiny, but she's got the biggest parakeets in town. She's got cockatoos and bobolinks and royal blue and dusty pinks. You should see them hanging upside down. Oh, it's thrilling to behold her when she wings them past her shoulder, 'cause she's got the biggest parakeets in town. And every night when she gets into bed, she puts. Each one on a pillow. Oh, they sound like bing when they start to sing. Tweet willow, tweet willow, tweet willow. <laughs> After holding them and petting them, she gets a thrill in letting them go swinging from the ceiling to the ground. Ask anyone who's seen 'em; it's hard to choose between 'em 'cause she's got the biggest parakeets in town. Imagine her in love one day as she tells her fiance, "Okay, on the day the wedding rolls around." Now he loves the ground she stands on. He can't wait to get his eyes on the biggest parakeets in town. Well, picture on her wedding night when the hubby dear turns off the light and wakes in the morning with a frown. As he goes to caress her, he sees them on the dresser. <laughs> the biggest parakeets in town. She's really got a boy. The biggest parakeets in town. And Norman, 